Hello there and welcome back to my channel. I'm Yash and today I will teach you how to create table view without using storyboard. In fact, we will delete storyboard completely. So let's get started. I have already created a new project which is named no storyboard table view. I copied data model from my previous project. So just to save a, a, a bit of time and I'll just paste it in my view controller.swift file. Um, there are a bunch of animal names uh, you can just create your own and it says data model uh, so as I said we will be deleting storyboard so let's get started by deleting our main dot storyboard file I will say delete and move to trash and let's run the application for once and see what actually happens when we delete a storyboard file so and uh, we get some error and if you scroll up uh, it will read that the reason is could not find a storyboard named main in bundle so in order to get rid of this error first we need to go to info.plist file and find the key where it says main storyboard file base name and just get rid of the main of the string so double click and get rid of the value and just hit enter so it will be a blank space and now if you run the application you will see a black screen uh, no error but black screen that's it so now what we need to do is we need to create a window and give it some size so let's get started uh, under app.delegate I like to rename this variable so it will be iPhone window uh, you will know why I did that so First of all, iPhone window is equal to new UI window and open parentheses frame and here it will be UI screen dot view uh, dot main dot bounce. So basically this uh, UI screen dot main dot bounce will give the complete size of the window. So this is the screen. So this is the iPhone X screen. Uh, if we simulate an iPhone 5s screen, it will bound to its uh, its dimensions, so it will adapt. So basically, it's adaptive. So now we will uh, do optional binding. So if let window is equal to iPhone window and open close parentheses, and here we will say window dot root view controller is equal to our view controller file. And open close parentheses and we'll say window dot background color is equal to UI color dot white so this is the standard stuff and one last thing is window dot make key and visible so this will point uh, so this says that this is our initial view controller that's what we do right so let's run the application and we should get a white screen a normal white screen and yep it works so let's get started under view controller and now uh, all the steps are like basic table view steps so first of all i will need table view delegate and data source so delegate and table view data source now i need to create a variable which says table view and this will be of type ui table view and open close brackets and here we will say um, table view is equal to UI table view open brackets here frame will be self dot view dot bounce and style will be plain so dot so it's an enum just hit dot and hit plain now we will say table view dot uh, we give it frame now we need to give a background color so it will be a background color it will be UI color dot white and table view dot I don't like the scroll indicators so let's get rid of them as well so show show vertical scroll indicator and this will be false and now just assign table view delegate and it will be self uh, table view dot data source self again and we will just add this table view to our main view so self dot view dot add sub view and this will be a table view 
and now we need the basic table view functions so first is number of sections and here we will just say return one okay control L uh, I'll make a bunch of space so now I will say rows I guess it's number of rows in section and here I will just return data model dot count so once again this data model is this thing I just pasted it from my previous project just to save time and now we will create cell for row at index path and here we will say let cell equal to UI table view cell open brackets and style will be default and reuse identifier we don't need it so just nil so cell dot text label dot text is equal to data model open brackets and here just pass an index path dot row and return the cell so cool I guess that's it and let's run the application and see whether it works or not it should work so here we have it uh, I don't like the separators as well so I'll just get rid of them as well so I'll just say table view dot separator style and this will be dot none and let's run again and this time it should work fine the way I like it so it does not show scroll bar uh, actually it's because the data is low so let's just copy this I'll just copy this copy and paste paste and let's run for one last time so yeah no scroll indicator and uh, no separators as well so guys that's how you create a table view from like scratch without a storyboard and uh, if you have any questions post them in comments if you like my video thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for future videos until next time